What's up guys, it's Chris, your host for Eating Like a Local, the show where we uncover the best must-try menu items in the London area and beyond. Today, we're at Shelby's Food Express and we're here to try their brand new shawarma box. Let's see how it holds up. Hi, my name is Yasser Ali. I'm the Marketing and Operations Director of Shelby's Food Express. I've been here since day one, since we started in a little dinky trailer out in Lambeth. We're owners inside the restaurant, so we're tasting the food daily and making sure that it tastes right. And We make everything in-house because we have control over it. And to ensure that our flavors get made, we gotta make it. From our fresh sage bread that we make fresh daily every day, our chicken is skewered every day fresh, spices are toasted so you get the nice aromatic full flavor of the spices, our garlic sauce, our hummus, everything is made daily, made fresh, we're always on top of everything. Today we'll be making the shawarma box. It's a 20 inch long shawarma done on our homemade sage bread. We'll start off with the garlic sauce, a little bit of pickles, a little bit of french fries, and we'll put the chicken in the wrap, wrap it up, toast it, and then we'll cut it up into bite sized pieces and serve it to you in a box. As you can see, we got the shawarma box plated nicely for me and all my friends. We got one for everyone, everyone here. No, they're all for me. What we got going on in here, we got fries, pickles, chicken, some sauces, and a nice pomegranate molasses. As I've been told, it's referred to as Dips Roman. Probably butchered that. I know what tastes good. I don't know how to say it though, but we're gonna get right into this. This is looking fantastic. And we've been told that dipping it is the best way to go here. We got some spicy garlic, spicy garlic sauce right here. We're gonna get a nice coat of that. Mm. I don't know if anyone else used to do this, but when I would go as a kid and get burgers somewhere, I'd always put some fries into my burger. And I love that so much. And they put fries in the shawarma. They knew that it's good. Fries and shawarma makes perfect sense. What are you doing not putting fries in your shawarma? Fantastic. The other thing I really love is that this is so different from anything else you're gonna get in London especially because of this pomegranate molasses. It brings life to the dish. Like you've uh, got a little kick of spring in you and with this winter weather, we can definitely use it. So the pomegranate molasses is like that secret ingredient that kind of just glazes over everything, really wraps everything together very nicely. This isn't your average pita bread. This is better than anything else you're gonna get on the market in London. A lot of those other places, they just use store-bought pita bread. You know, sometimes they don't really keep it up fresh. It's not as good. Here at Shelby's, they make everything in-house that's includes their bread. The homemade bread here is so critical because it's soft. It's got that perfect consistency where it's not overly chewy. It's not too thin. It's not going to break on you. The bread here has its own unique flavor that totally combines with everything else on the plate right now. Now, if you're going to go to Syria, Jordan, Palestine, any of those places where you're expecting to get great Middle Eastern food, you don't need to go. You can stay right here in London and just go to Shelby's. This place is fantastic. They do it exactly how they do it over there. Everything's homemade. Nothing store-bought or overly processed. They know exactly what they're doing over here. This is true Middle Eastern food right here in London, Ontario. Don't sleep on Shelby's. Get your ass over here now. Get yourself a shawarma box. Hey guys, thanks so much for joining us at Shelby's Food Express today. We took home the shawarma box and it was the best decision we've made all day. Go get one for yourself. That pomegranate molasses, man, Mwah. so good. This is Chris Downs for Eating Like a Local, signing off. See you at the next one. Peace.